What's up, you guys? This is Divine Messenger 33. Where I get messages from the Divine, I give them straight to you guys. So clearing out any energy that will not benefit this message. Holy Spirit, Archangel Michael, my ancestors, my spirit guides of my highest good, please come in and protect me as I channel this current energy for the collective. Please give me clear and accurate messages, ancestors of my highest good. Welcome all my supporters. I appreciate you guys for liking and commenting and subscribing to the channel. I appreciate all of the love, the support, the donations, the bookings, the emails. I appreciate you guys for all the love and the support you show to me as a channel. I appreciate y'all. So let's get into it and see what is going on with the collective. What are the messages? What are our messages? What are the messages, Spirit? What are the messages? All right, Ten of Cups in the reverse. Damn, Nine of Swords. So damn, so somebody could be in their head because some things could be upside down with them. Oh, shit. Okay. Some things are upside down for somebody at this time. All right. Let's see. Somebody is not happy about something going on with their family. All right. Let's see. What's going on, spirit? Yeah. Ten of Wands. Somebody could have a lot on their on the back right now. Yeah, Four of Swords. Current Energy. Justice. So this person could feel like very like overloaded. It's a lot going on in their energy. This person could, this person could have a lot of things that they praying about when it comes to court. Seven of Cups. Three of Swords. Chariot. Hey, man. So this person could have a lot on their back when it comes to court. Somebody can. All right. I'm seeing like somebody could be trying to go through like their options. And somebody feel like that they don't have any options. So somebody could just feel stuck. One more. Yeah, this person could just feel stuck. Yeah, Will of Fortune, bottom of the deck, and we have the devil. So, for some of you guys, whoever this person is, this person is not having the wish fulfillment that they thought that they was going to have. And this person could be really in their head and overloaded. So, for some of y'all, I'm hearing this person is thinking about switching energies. So, this person is thinking about going into a different energy to get what it is that they want. Because this person felt like that the weight is on their shoulders too heavy. And this person is like, okay, I'm going to get into another energy and get the things that I want or something like that. Okay? Because some things could be upside down for somebody. And that's just what they're thinking about. Also, I'm hearing somebody is about to have... A good turning point in their destiny is what I'm seeing. Clarify this ten of wands. So we got strong Libra. We got Sagittarius, Aries, Pisces, Capricorn. What's this ten of wands, spirit? What's this ten of wands? Yep. What's a seven of cups? This person is really like in their head about what it is that they could have going on. For some of y'all, if this got something to do with a family member, this is a family member that they could stay having legal trouble. This person could smoke, uh, smoke a lot of uh, marijuana too. Okay, whoever this person is. 
Clarify Four of Swords. Clarify Four of Swords. Yeah. Moon card is in the reverse because I feel like that this person. Yep, Page of Pentacles. So evidence came out about this person. Yep, some kind of tape or some kind of recording came out about this person. Yep. So this could have been something somebody was trying to keep hidden, but it's about to be exposed though. Okay. And I'm hearing it's going to turn this person world upside down because on what is about to be exposed. Justice. Clarify justice. Temperance. Yeah. But this is somebody guardian angel giving them justice. Yep. Exactly. Ace of Swords. So I'm hearing for a lot of you guys, things are about to flow more smoother. Because whoever this person is that was in your energy, I feel like that the skills are being balanced out. This could have been somebody that uh, tried to fuck up your whatever that made you happy and fulfilled. This person could have tried to fuck that up. Clarify seven of cups. Clarify seven of cups. Seven of cups. Empress. Ace of swords. So somebody could be looking up surgery. Somebody looking up some kind of surgery. Okay, I mean emperor. This says emperor. So for a lot of you guys, somebody could have been in their head because they could have went within and seen that somebody had a whole lot of options. And it was strong clarity too. Like somebody, this clarity that came through, it was like no denial. I feel like this emperor was searching for something and they found it. <laughs> That's what I'm seeing here. Yeah, Will of Fortune. It changed everything. Yep, this, whatever this emperor found, it changed everything in the connection. Clarify Three of Swords. What's this Three of Swords? Exactly. Nine of Pentacles, somebody single. They single. Yep, Eight of Cups. Somebody is disappointed, emotionally walking away from the shit. Yep, and I'm hearing somebody is choosing themselves. Something to do with a Libra or a Virgo. Or this person is choosing to... Yeah. Be single. Like I said, clarify the hangman. Yep, Six of Pentacles. Page of Swords. So, somebody may uh, look up some kind of help or something like that. Or somebody, I'm seeing like somebody may be led to look at something in a different light that'll pay them good. So, something to do with a Taurus, Aries, Pisces, or a Gemini. Somebody needs to relook at something. Because there's an opportunity that you may feel like that ain't going to pay you right. And this motherfucker going to pay you good as hell. I'm hearing you may even like go to a high position or you may do something big or something. Yeah, because what I'm seeing is for a lot of you guys, this hangman position with whoever this person is, it's got them kind of stuck because this person need a lot of help for some of y'all. Whoever this person is, it's like they need a lot of help. Because it's like everything in their family dynamic, it's like it's falling apart. Yeah. But I'm hearing like these change of events is going to turn this person into a totally different individual. Will of Fortune. Clarify this Will of Fortune. For some of y'all, this is a family member that you have to kick out. Will of Fortune. Yeah. So, 
basically what I'm seeing, these change of events, I mean, somebody going to end up in jail, possibly. Or this could be a situation where somebody is going to get justice and their justice is going to be their happiness. So somebody is just going to have to watch somebody be happy or this is a situation where somebody, I mean, something may lead to court. Also, somebody is going to get some kind of um, clarity about somebody putting something in their drink. Something to do with a Libra or a Sagittarius. Somebody is going to get some clarity that somebody put something in their drink or something. That's what I'm getting. But this whole energy... Like, if somebody is in their head about this Ten of Cups in reverse, it was toxic anyway. So, I mean, it was it was meant to be gone. This, this wasn't meant for it to, you know, last forever. This was meant to teach somebody a lesson and to go to the next level. Okay? I mean, a lot of times the reason why people are hurt is because they stay in situations longer than what they're supposed to. People get all kind of confirmations and then they stay in situations longer than what they should be, than what they should stay in, okay? And I've had that problem too, y'all, so shit. I mean... This is giving me an energy of somebody always making somebody unhappy. Like somebody could be trying to like make things work, but the inner part of them is like they're not happy. Yeah. All right, let's see. Current energy. Well, this is good. That fell out. Financial and material changes. Financial and material prosperity and stand your ground. So that's good ass energy shit. Let's see if that something come back out. Let's see. <laughs> All right, spirit. Current energy. Yep. We got movement choices and decisions. And we have new beginnings. So this is giving me an energy where somebody has made a decision to leave something behind. Yep. Something to do with 20, 2020. Something to do with Aquarius. Somebody can have a two-year-old. Yep. But that's what I'm getting. This person is in their fucking head about this situation they going through, bruh. This is heavy. I am seeing for the ones that's on the good side, something will be balanced out in court. Okay, so something will be balanced out in court. Somebody could have something coming up and things will be balanced out here. Okay, when it comes to court. But I am seeing that whoever this person is in your energy that's in their head, this person could be having like some kind of new perspective when it comes to you. Yeah, somebody could be like looking more in depth when it comes to some things here. Because for a lot of y'all, whoever this person is in your head, you need to listen to your intuition about it and, and make the moves that you need. Yeah. That's what I'm that's what I'm hearing, seeing, and feeling, y'all. Okay, so Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. We got strong Gemini. Aries, Leo, Sag. We have Sagittarius and Aries. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. We got Cancer and Scorpio. All right. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. We got Virgo and Capricorn. All right. So only take or resonate. 
and leave the rest in your situation. But I'm definitely seeing somebody in their head about walking away or a family dynamic being upside down. Like somebody's in their head about that shit. All right, energy. Single. That's the vibe I was getting. Somebody could be about to be single in a situation. Or this could have something to do with somebody single. College graduate. Current energy. Thin, so somebody could be real thin on the thin side. We have you, college graduate. Somebody could be a hacker, fur coats, Q. So this giving me an energy for somebody. This could have been a family member that was hacking into your shit. For some of y'all, this could have been a stay-at-home dad person with colored eyes. Don't have to be. Chill, forward, we have I, watch, French tip, separated, military, wine, yep, succubus, I'm telling you, there's a succubus energy in the mix, sunglasses, Aries, Something to do with Aquarius. Somebody could have two children. Or something to do with a two-year-old. 60s. We have somebody that's real thick. Somebody could have some big-ass feet. We have miscarriage. Full lips. I'm telling you. A fake asshole. Alright, so we got Capricorn. Something to do with 21, 2021. Alright. Something about an IQ. Somebody could have a um, high IQ. Okay. Something with Lilies. Something with Leanne. Something with Courtney. Something with Quantrell or Quan. Alright, you guys, I'm going to leave it there. Like, comment, and subscribe. Also, somebody child could have a number 21 or a number 12 when they play sports or something like that. So, somebody child could, you know, have that as well. Okay, somebody could be a tattoo artist or somebody could have just got a tattoo. A new one. I heard Cody, something with Colleen, something with Shantae, or Shannon, Sherelle. All right, you guys, like, comment, and subscribe. Look in the description box below for the services that I provide. And with that, you guys, peace and love.